Heath Mulliken and Mark Whitman here. Mark, we just uh, witnessed the inaugural show for Golden Corner Wrestling. And what a show it was. What a great night from top to bottom, first match to the last match. Just a great night of wrestling. Great night of professional wrestling. This, we, we didn't watch a sports entertainment show tonight. No. We watched professional wrestling tonight. Uh, absolutely uh, amazing. If you just watched it, our opening match was Dirty versus Josh Oglesby. Whether you like it or not, Oglesby went away with a victory tonight. Yeah, and he did, and I liked it. You say whether I like it or not, I liked it. Well, I don't think everybody quite agrees with you. Our second well, it match. It doesn't matter what they think. Second match, two contrasting styles, yep. Deion Johnson and Ace Armstrong. We said it in the pre-show, whoever controlled the style of the match was going to win, and that's what Deion Johnson that's exactly did. right. Deion Johnson went in, and he had his match, and he walked away, and he won. Great, uh, great, great fight there. And then we saw two of the best young athletes who had a few choice words for each other before the show even started. Jack Jackson James and BK, BJ Hancock fought all over the gym tonight. Yeah, they did. And it was it was a great, great match. I think uh, that we're going to see these two men in the ring here again. Yeah. I don't think it's over. I think, matter of fact, I think it's far from over. No, no. And I think tonight, with what BJ Hancock said about Seneca, Tonight, he made it personal. He did, and I, I agreed with everything he had to say about Seneca. Uh, I don't think he misspoke or misrepresented the people of Seneca in any way. Give uh, me a I break. I don't think I misspoke or misrepresented the people of Seneca in any way. But then we had. But more importantly, Jackson James walks away with the win. He did. Uh, I feel like the wrong man won tonight. But I'm entitled to my opinion just like everybody else. Jackson James won the match, but B.J. Hancock gave him everything he could handle. No doubt. What it, what, whoever won, it was an incredible match. Our tag team title match, the Sons of Steel challenging the champions, the Delta Squad. What a great, great match. Colonel Stud did get involved. He did play a part like I knew that he would. He, he, he's one of the greatest managers in wrestling today. That's exactly right. Even though we may disagree with his tactics. And the Delta Squad, based on what I see, based on the fact that they hold the GCW tag team title, one of the best tag teams in wrestling today. I wouldn't be surprised this match tonight ended in a double count out. Uh, referee Ray Boring, let him go. Uh, let him fight. Let him bring in did. some weapons. And they and what? fought all over the arena. and. Uh, double count out. I wouldn't be surprised to see these two teams meet up again. No, I think there's no doubt we'll see it. We'll see this match again. And the Sons of Steel. I mean, they give uh, they give the Delta Squad all they wanted tonight, man. It was a it was a good showing from them too. There were uh, some real men in that match. Just yes. hard hitting action from start to finish. And then we had our main event: Caprice Coleman and Cedric Alexander. If you weren't here for that match and, and you, you didn't want, I mean, it was, you missed something special here tonight. You, you know, missed something special. Mark, you accused me of exaggerating, but I don't know if there's words enough for me to exaggerate how great that match was. No, it absolutely was a phenomenal match, uh, top to bottom. I mean, two guys starting out uh, applying wrestling holds, counter holds, uh, and then it just breaks out into a fight between the two, and it was about who wanted it more and who, who wound up hitting their big move. The turning point in that match came, Cedric Alexander had complete control. As a matter of fact, I said to you that maybe referee Ray Bourne should stop that match. Yeah. And Cedric Alexander, Alexander spit on his mentor, and it brought something alive. In I saw Coleman. it in his face. I saw it happen. It happened uh, 10 feet in front of me, yeah. and the man's eyes were glazed over. He was out, and Cedric Alexander had him right where he wanted, and he had a miscalculation, a misstep, and he spit in the face. Spit in the face of Caprice Coleman, and I saw his eyes come back to life because that's all it took to wake the man up. Yeah, it was a, uh, an amazing match, and after that comeback, Caprice Coleman did win the match and then shared his, his testimony, his faith in Jesus Christ. Mark, what a privilege it was. Uh, despite our differences on some things, what an honor to be here next to you right here ringside for this inaugural Golden Corner Wrestling Show. Any final thoughts you want to share with the fans? Um... Uh, no, I don't think so. The fans don't seem to care about my thoughts on anything, and I don't care about their thoughts on anything. So, Well, the fans here tonight uh, enjoyed this great, great card from start to finish. They were into the matches. 
They had a great time. We want to thank everybody for coming out. We want to thank everybody that brought school supplies. We want to thank all of our great sponsors. And you want to keep up with what's happening at Golden Corner Wrestling, go to goldencornerwrestling.com. It's where you can keep up our next event, October 31st in Westminster. Uh, find us on Facebook at Golden Corner Wrestling. Also, hey, if you like what you heard, Mark Whitman and I, DoubleDropKick.com, the Double Dropkick show every week where we talk about the wrestling you grew up with. And if you're on Facebook and like talking about wrestling, you can go to our Facebook page or our Facebook group, The Wrestling You Grew Up With. We'd love to hear your thoughts about this match. We're on Twitter. I'm at Heath Mulligan Marks. I'm at the DDK Show. We would love to hear from you. We love talking about wrestling. We love being a part of wrestling. And we would love to see you at our next show for Golden Corner Wrestling. So for Mark Whitman, I'm Heath Mulligan, and thanks for being here with us tonight.